What's going on YouTube? Two and I Brothers back at it with another reaction. My name's Jake. I'm with my brother Alex and our cousin Evan. And today, uh, literally like a couple hours ago, uh, Dax, who I've I Hopped love up in the Dax's feed. fucking songs, man. I love all of his songs. Yeah, you've shown me a couple. Man, yeah. yeah, is like super powerful. He's always got um, deep messages in his songs, which is super cool. Deep. You know, he doesn't just sing about anything. You know, he really oh. like. Evan, do you, do you listen to Dax at all, dude? I feel like I should lie and say yes. Otherwise, I'm going to be the, the nerd <laughs> in the group. But no, I don't. Bro, we, we might have to. Might have to we might have to revisit some of his look songs. Look at some of his guys. stuff. Yeah. Yeah, um, but yeah, we just saw he did a remix of Oliver Anthony's Richmond, North of Richmond, which we just did that like last week. And that, yeah, song, that song obviously was, has been that song popping. had huge it's messages popping off super, everywhere. you know. Yeah, and so for Dax to do a remix on that, you know it's gonna be fucking lit. Fire. Dude. Okay. It's gonna be Dude, yeah. I'm excited to what he has. I At City mostly baby. with his messaging, yes. you know, not even like what it the the beat's gonna be like or anything like that. Just like what he has to say say about it. Okay. Cause I'm sure he's gonna relate and he's gonna add his own. So I, I, I know two cents. I know when he remixes songs, when he remixes songs, like um normally he stays pretty true to the beat okay. for the most part. So I you know, but again, like Oliver Anthony's didn't have much of like a it was just him with the guitar. So maybe he does have to throw some layers on top of that to like, Probably. but yeah. I don't know, man. You know, I think people were disappointed in our reaction for Oliver Anthony's because we didn't dive deep enough into the lyrics themselves. You know, some we chose not to some, you yeah, know, some were so, pretty yeah. sensitive. But also, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that like there's some things that are just going to stick with us more than other people, you know, and I think that's just something, especially like songs like this. There's going to be some parts where you're like, that's what I relate to more exactly. that that that's more you know, like what's happened in my life. And so you're going to feel a more personal connection to that kind of thing. So, yeah, just be respectful of everyone's uh, life and how they resonate with different uh, songs. So let's get into Absolutely. it. I'm excited to see what goes on. Yeah, me too. Facts. It's a damn shame what the world's gotten to for people like me, people like you. Wish I could just wake up and it not be true, but it is. Oh, it is living in the new world with a whole soul. The rich men know the rich men, Lord knows, they all just wanna have. Oh, I had to accept it. Yeah, I was gonna say pause before he starts, dude, because even that intro, like, still gave me goosebumps, dude. Dude, dude, a wait, little bit, yeah. Of course, man. This dude. song always gives me goosebumps. I was literally at Home Depot two days ago, and some guy was blasting this song in his car, and I got goosebumps. <laughs> dude, yeah, yeah. Uh, sorry, dude. I wanted to pause before he starts getting into the raps, just to say, like, it's so that's so powerful, man. Like. There is not a middle class, lower class American who does not relate to that song. And I don't even yeah. think it's American too. There it's is. it's spread across well, the world, yeah. dude. It's, it's like it it, it people has resonated all across the world. Over the world. Have, but I, you know, yeah, I was I, listening to the top one hundred songs in the UK and it popped up while that, I was listening. Yeah. yeah. It's you know, crazy. But, you know, I don't want to talk for other people. No, I know. You and, uh, you know, it, because I, you know, I've been to other countries, but, you know, I haven't. Yeah, you know, he doesn't I, talk. I he doesn't talk. talk to, he doesn't talk to other people from other countries. So, <laughs> OK, let's go. <laughs> Roll it back. Roll back yeah. This world has changed and I had to accept it. They ask my political views while I search for their hidden agendas. I don't got an answer. I try to remember the devil divides. Pressure appears from our peers. Those arguments waste our time while helping to push their lies. So fuck political views. I got common sense. I know God made man. 
And the sun sets on a life where we focus on things that we cannot control And accumulate so much regret By the time we decide to live, we're practically already dead So I go to sleep with the thoughts of 45 years living in debt 45 years can't pay rent 45 years just for a pension I'm too old to enjoy and go spend 45 years working and slaving for rich men With no time for my family and friends Then I wake up and pray that it ends yeah yeah Bro. you know first thing that sticks to my mind is listening to oliver anthony's version and we had a few comments people going like this is like should be like the republicans song you know, like they're like the song for their platform and then people had to step in you know and be like hey like this is politics in general this is both sides Not this, yeah, is a, yeah. this actually, isn't dude i've seen time. people call him like made a tw- for the left and for the right i've exactly. seen people yeah. think that he is like supporting both sides and he, people hate he, him on both sides for that well he made a tweet about how he is not does not want to be part of any political agenda at at all like no. that's not what that yeah song no, was about totally. at all yeah um and I like I like how Dax gets into like he's like you know I kind of just have my common sense and I think that that's that's really what politics comes down to and why people disagree so much because where you come from and where you grew up you're gonna have different problems you're gonna have different issues and you're gonna see the world a little differently so when it comes time to yeah. voting on something that's a very big issue that's gonna affect everyone you're obviously gonna run into different opinions different views yeah and it seems like yeah. a lot of people are just gonna take. You know, sometimes people don't look into it as much and they just kind of vote for the side, you know, that they vote for instead of digging deep and looking at policies and things like that and voting yeah. on the person instead of the party. It is a lot I mean? taking the time and it, it, it you know, it's, it's, it takes time out of your day yeah. to like research all this shit and you, sometimes you don't even know what the fuck you're reading. Yeah. You know? <laughs> and then, yeah. And then Dax over here talking about 40 plus years, you know, that. That's what I was going to point out next, dude. Yeah, that, that's what I was going to point out next that resonated with me. Me, was, me too. Uh, yeah. <laughs> the forty-five years living in debt, forty-five years just trying to pay rent. Like by the time you decide, like fuck all that, like it's just time to live. Like you're already dead. And that I was yeah. like, God, dude, yes, dude, yes. Holy yeah. shit, man. No, totally. Yeah. I totally agree. All right, let's pull it back a little bit. See, see what the next one. Then I'll wake up and pray that it ends. Living in the new world. With an old soul. The rich men know the rich men. Lord knows they all just want to have total control. Descendants of Adam and Eve. The apple doesn't fall far from the tree. They're taking God out the schools. Our kids don't know what to believe. From 6 to 18, the curriculum fails and Gen Z gets taught by their phones with forced feeds that get sponsored and paid by companies. That's how they attack us. It starts with the youth. If you lie enough, you'll convince anybody the lies, the truth. So telling these kids they can choose their own gender at ages they can't even tie their own shoes. Drive or drink is crazy. Common sense isn't common unless it pays me. That's the thought process daily. Look at the content. We're creating lies, diluting our brains. I'm done trying to argue online with these people who think that a vote's gonna bring about change. How many presidents does it take to have have a life worth living, an actual comfortable wage, no more school shootings. Let's unite these states. It's a damn shame. God what? damn, bro. Dude, he hit so like literally. It's like, uh, let me just go through and hit every sensitive topic uh, that's been going on. And it's right sensitive now. topics. Fucking... It's sensitive topics on both sides. You know what I mean? Oh, 100%. that's the crazy yeah. part. Yeah, yeah. I think the one and, that that I want to hit on is like the the social media. Because I think everyone can relate to like being Every sitting match. there and being like just fucking hooked. And then you're like, dude, it's been two hours. Like I've just sat here and scrolled and I just want to look for the next fucking viral video or whatever the fuck that tickles your fancy. And you just sit there and sit there but, you and know, scroll and he, scroll. And yeah. Scroll. And then yeah. him talking about, you know, dude. you know, they censor a lot of things on social media. There's a lot of yeah. untold truths on social media. Is it, you if, you t- I mean? if you pick up someone else's phone and scroll through their Instagram reels, it is completely different because it is 100% tailored to you. Like they know how you think, yeah. they know what you like to buy, what hobbies you're into, they know all about yeah, it. Dude. And they know where you yeah, live, you know, they know everything. So they're going to send you shit that's what's one of one of his you. lines, one of his lines where he's like 
you know, you're fed the truth by like, oh, fuck, dude, I wish I wish I knew what the line was, but it's about being like fed lies but you think it's the truth yeah because there's like companies paying for it and stuff and like yeah the companies are paying it, for the it, content because they're sponsoring this shit to send to you it, to dude, target you that shit. yeah that shit you know that resonated with me a lot like that is why i like essentially got rid of my social media was because it was just not a healthy way to spend my time it's and like exercise my mental health you know yeah so i i you know Personally, yeah, I, I don't have any social medias um, because don't, yeah, you don't. You really don't. It's sometimes it's hard because I find so the many. Only reels social that media you should have <laughs> is a Twitter and Instagram account that only follow Two and a Half Brothers official. That's all you need. <laughs> Shameless we, plug, dude. <laughs> we Shameless plug. Dude. Tell the whole truth and nothing but the truth. So help me God. How are you gonna you know, know I mean? when our content drops? Yeah, how are you gonna know and you know i don't have a facebook though i really don't i don't have a tiktok <laughs> I, yeah i only do instagram and then i follow two and a half brothers on twitter oh, shameless that's plugs it. dude that ain't, that ain't a plug dude. that's just facts oh, All right, let's hold this, back this. anyways dude yeah 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 hold one back. more verse for us no more school shootings let's unite these states it's a damn shame what the world's gotten to for people like me People like you wish I could just wake up and it not be true, but it is. Oh, it is living in the new world with an old soul. These rich men north, the rich men, Lord knows, they all just want to have total control. It's just constant goosebumps, man. That, um, that was, he absolutely destroyed that remix. He did it justice. It was beautiful. You know what I mean? He added really to it flawlessly. He had a it lot of great. depth flawlessly. You're 100. percent I couldn't agree more with you. So much depth, depth flawlessly to that song. And yeah, yeah. It it really like, like I said, man. Like he hit. In three minutes and three seconds, shout out 303, uh, he hit every major issue that, you know, not just this, like, I was about to say this country, even though I'm not in the States right now, but like that the United States and most countries are dealing with. And, you know, everyone has their own opinions on that. And it, we're, we're going to, you know, ask the comment sections to probably chill the fuck out. Uh, yeah, yeah, we know that we know the things we skipped out on. And we skipped out yeah. on them for a reason. We, we're not taking we political not, sides yeah. here. Re realize and that. Yeah. Just know that if you, I legally if, can't. If someone leaves can't. their opinion, <laughs> I think that's fine. Like respectfully, leave your opinion. But if people start attacking other people, then obviously we're going to delete those comments. Yeah, and, and don't try to make us probably be banned from the like, channel. Yeah. So don't do that. It seems like a lot of people were talking about how we're young and we just don't understand things. It's like, dude, you don't know what we've been through. So yeah, you, know, you can't speak for yourself. other people yeah. and yeah, just you speak been, for what been, you do know, which yeah. is you, yourself. So you've been living in your yeah. same hometown for fifty six years, Sharon. You shut the fuck up. <laughs> you know what I mean? You don't tell us about anything. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> oh dude. man. Yeah. Well, let us know what you thought down below in the comment section and make sure you guys smash the like button down below. It really helps the video out a lot and the channel and make sure you guys subscribe so you get all of our content that comes out in the future and follow us on social media. If you didn't know already, we're on X and Instagram at TA. We'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.